Hey everyone, this is Kenesha from Very Thoughtful. Today I wanted to come to you to invite you to join me on a 30 day adventure that I'm calling Doing It Afraid. So a lot of times most of us miss out on living our dreams or um, even the, like the little things, challenging ourselves to do the small things because we're so afraid, so afraid of what people think, so afraid of failing um, or getting it wrong or just those negative thoughts that happens in our head like how am I going to do that or who am I to try to do that so April 1st I want you guys to go to, before April 1st I want you to go to my website and log on and tell me if you're going to join me on this challenge and what I want us to do is we I will do a video once a week um, to, to get us all you know talk about what this week is, is about I will share with you my challenge for the week the thing that I plan to do afraid but also, I want us to keep in touch. Like, I want us to try to keep each other motivated. Um, we can share maybe scriptures or passages or anything that keeps us motivated to do it afraid. Because the thing about fear, it never goes away. And so when you see people who are living these great lives, who are being amazing, like an Oprah Winfrey or my favorite, Tony Roberts, it's not that they, they are never afraid. It's just that they've learned to do it with the fear. So let's do that. Let's commit beginning April 1st that we're going to do this series called Doing It Afraid. So if you guys will help me out, join join the the, the movement with me. Um, let's do this together. Let's schedule Google Hangouts where we talk about what is the thing that we want to do afraid. And then we can get on the Google Hangout and also talk about ways to encourage each other. I don't care how big or how small it is. Yesterday for me, it was just riding the subway system by myself we've been in Beijing for a year and a half now and I've only ever ridden the subway with Andre and so honestly I never paid attention when we would go and get off different stops and go to different locations I just didn't pay attention because I didn't have to because he was there with me well it's getting it's starting to be nice over here um, I spent a, a lot of days by myself it's been great there are days I can be extremely productive with my writing um, and I'm making connection God is great in that way I want to share that with you guys too but I wanted to learn that subway system so that if it's a day I want to go somewhere, I don't have to pay a driver 200 kwai to go sit there and wait for me when I can pay two kwai, which is less than a dollar, to go anywhere I want to in the city. So that was my thing. So yesterday I did it. I, I got out there. I have a little app and I thought, you know what? What's the worst can happen? I can get lost. I can call somebody to help me. I had enough money on me, I can get a text if I need to. It was not that bad. In fact, it was amazing. I was I had peace the whole time. There was no anxiety. The stop that I knew to get off on, that Andre told me about, that my app told me about, the train didn't stop there. <laughs> it would just skip right past the stop. Like I'm looking at it on the board and the light lit up and then it went off and it never stopped at that stop. So I had to really pour into God, like trust, like, okay, Lord, I can read. <laughs> I'm an intelligent person. I can read. I can do this. And so I, I looked at my little map, my app, figured out a new route, took it. So even though it didn't go smoothly, what I learned in that was, one, that God is amazing because I stayed had peace the entire time. Two, now I have full confidence that I can operate and move in that, that subway system with no problem because I had to do it yesterday. So I want us to all start to live our dreams because dreams do not expire. I want us to live amazing lives, great lives. Um, but I know that the greatness that we truly desire is always on the other side of fear. So come on, join with me, do this with me. So this today is, I don't know, March. Let me see. I have no idea what today's date is. But you have a few days to sign up to pray about it, think about the things that you want to do, things that you want to commit to sharing with the group um, so that we can encourage each other and do it afraid. So I hope to hear from you. I'm going to keep posting videos, but on April 1st, I want us to get started. What are we going to do that week or that day afraid that we've been putting off for a long time? I hope you join me, verythoughtfullife.com. Go to the website. You'll see on the home page a place where you can sign up. It's called, the challenge is called doing, living afraid, doing it afraid. We're going to call it doing it afraid. I look forward to seeing you guys. I look forward to hearing from you guys. Once you guys sign up, you will get, uh, I'm also going to send you out like encouraging words through the week. So maybe once a week, I send you an email to encourage you with scripture or a word to help you 
move towards that, but also send me stuff. Encourage me too. So I love you guys. Let's do this together. Let's live our dreams and let's live them afraid.